Hey y'all, Dekamon here, and welcome to something a little special today. Uh, you might notice I'm talking a little quieter than usual. Well, it's five in the morning here. I'm trying not to wake everybody up. And honestly, I'm not fully awake myself. But, well, I wanted to get this out for you guys because something special just dropped on the interwebs. The Dawn Trail Job Actions Trailer. And I am looking forward to doing something I've never really done before, which is a live reaction to a trailer for you guys. Oh, it, it's just something special. Also, I get, you know, I get to use my camera more. I'm always happy to use my camera for something special like this. Hmm. Uh, speaking of Dawn Trail, I do kind of have a bit of a mixed bag piece of news. See, Dawn Trail's launch comes at a rather awkward time. My family has this tradition where we have this big get together right around the 4th every year, which means I have to pack up, get on a plane, and fly all the way across the country. Which means I can't play Dawn Trail at launch. Ah, oh, it so sucks. But I can bring my laptop. My laptop is strong enough to play 14. So what my plan is currently is I'm going to be taking a little time. You know, I've got a whole week with family here. So I'll take a little bit of that weekend time and try and get Pictomancer to level 90. Fingers crossed that we'll be starting Pictomancer with the Dawn Trail LP. I cannot wait. Oh, I also can't wait to see what all of these cool job actions are. This, this is gonna be wild, because this thing is 21 minutes long. It is massive. Ugh. Oh, and if anyone's worried, don't worry. There will be a regular LP video up later today at the usual-ish time. <laughs> now, let's swap over here and let's take a look at the Dawn Trail Job Actions Trailer. My mouse out of the way here first. Ooh, man, we get fancy with these. All right, yeah, the, the studio changed technically from Creative Business Unit 3 to Creative Studio 3. <gasps> the Viper Limit Break? <gasps> That's bonkers looking. Oh, oh, I want a real set of job crystals. Those look so cool. <gasps> right off the bat, Dragoon. Dragoon's getting a bunch of changes. I can't wait to see what it looks like. Battle Litany. Oh, they have a dash now. Oh my god, jump is fast. Mirage Dive. Dragon Fire Dive, yep, okay. Oh, that's new. That was definitely new. That looks pretty new, too. Okay. Man had a steroid. He has another steroid. We've seen that one before. Nastrum. Or, Gear Skull Go, there's Nastrum. Yep. That's still there. Whoa! That must be his new capstone ability. What? <laughs> okay. That even looks like my character! Hmm. I don't recognize that one. Okay. No, that's still the same. Holy Sheltron. Oh, that's new. Oh, that's definitely new. The backhanded sword. Whoa! Wings of Light. Still one of my favorite tank skills of all times is Wings of Light. Oh. Uh, here come the rain swords. One more? Ah, oh. oh, yes, the Rhinosaurus gets a new tag. Oh, stick with the tanks. Dude, I am, I'm digging this music. I am digging this music. Whoa! Oh, is that the new Falk leave that just came out? Ooh. I like that animation with the shields. 
There's the foul cleaves. Oh, just one. Oh, and a two. Oh, he's popping steroids between every one of these. <laughs> and there was his 90 capstone. <laughs> My man put a big rock on his axe and said, eat it. Oh, Astro, Astro, oh. That's new. The job gauge changed. Oh, they can store multiple cards at a time. Okay. Oh. Oh, what was that? Oh, whoa. The 12. <laughs> oh. Oh, he just loaded up his whole deck. Oh, the Minor Arcanas are AoEs now! Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Hitting out them cards. Interesting, they're not building the symbols up anymore. Dancer? Alright. <laughs> I love it in the top corner it says version 7.0. Oh, they're... Oh, their fan gauge now glows when it's maxed out. Still got the fourfold fans. <laughs> Improvise. Oh, it doesn't even have to be full, it just glows on its own. Yep, I remember seeing that. That's definitely new for Dancer. Yep. Get our fourfold dance in. Oh, they're faster now! The dance steps are faster now, that's so good! Oh. <laughs> oh, orbital lasers! Oh, Reaper, Reaper, come on! Let's see some cool Reaper shit. God, job gauge hasn't changed any. Alright, scoop some blood. That was new. <laughs> ah, shroud gauge install. That was a new ability. That was very new. That big old crystal that came up. Yeah. Music change. Ah, Red Mage. Tornado. Right, spend mana, spend mana. Yep, get your three charges. Spend on a big AoE. Okay. Whoa. Okay, the Rose Thorn thing was cool. Standard combo. Go for Flare. Into Scorch. Into the Deadly Beam. <laughs> oh my god. That was awesome looking. Ooh, Machinist. I actually spent some time on Machinist just the other day. Yep. Drop gauge looks the same. Got the Flamethrower. There's the Buzzsaw Blaster. Big Buzzsaw Blaster. I'm gonna say that's an upgrade to Drill. No, they still have Drill. Air Anchor. Bio Blaster. Yeah, I remember all of these. Call in the Queen. Go for the Wildfire. Oh, the Wildfire animation's different. That's different too. Oh, they get upgraded versions of those fast spenders. Drill again. What the <laughs> My man had a whole ass arsenal there for a second. Ninja. Oh, they've got a new job gauge. Looks like they're storing kunais. Oh. 
was cool looking. <gasps> yeah, they just uh, they just got two kunais. Wait. Do they not have to keep up the buff anymore? Whoa, Toad is scary now. Let's see, yeah, they haven't, uh... Okay. That's very interesting. They don't have to keep the wind buff up anymore. Did they just straight up remove that? Dude, that's gonna be wild to play Ninja now with that gone. Because that was a big part of Ninja, was keeping that buff going constantly. That's cool. <laughs> I've seriously still gushed over Ninja, and I'm watching the Sage just go off. Interesting, Sage doesn't have an ally with it. Did they not get any new ally abilities? I think the animation looks nice. That's new. Huh. Not sure how I feel about the sage there. That's interesting. Oh, Black Mage just got a new gauge. Whoa! Wait a minute. They have three Xenoglossy charges? That sounds awesome. Oh. Oh. Okay, we're building arrows. We're building arrows. Oh, zip to a person. Zip. Oh. They no longer go to the ley lines. They bring the ley lines to them. We got six. What does six get us? Despair. <laughs> six gets them a really big nuke. Some flare action on. Oh, did flares just give them instant charges? I think it did. Alright. Brand new class. Let's see that Viper. Okay. Liking it so far. I'm liking it go for oh yep, got the got the obligatory dash. Oh, the sword's getting. And the sword's getting glows on it. And we've got a meter. <laughs> I'm supposed to be watching the meters. I'm not watching the animations. The animations are so smooth. Ooh. Okay, there's some AoE action going. Steroid to immediately get some charges. Oh. Holy <laughs> freaking <laughs> My man is a freaking nut! What the shit? Okay, I might be playing Viper instead of Pictomancer, unless Pictomancer can show me something cooler, because that looked awesome! Alright. White Mage already got the... got the little vial down. That poor tank just took it on the chin. Ooh. Did they spend that? Shield? I think they already had that shield. Unfortunately, I'm not super familiar with White Mage, so... Oh, those are fast casts. Yep, the wings. He's still got the wings. The dash seemed new. Holy two. That one was new. That last ability was definitely new there. Monk. Still haven't finished leveling up Monk. But I definitely see a new addition to their gauge right in the middle. Still got the chakras. Going through the stances. Interesting. Stance on and stance off now, huh? Okay. Interesting. That game.
gauge, that new gauge, I'm very curious about that. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, his, his chakra gauge is glowing now all of a sudden. <laughs> Through a freaking goddamn a token at the last second. Okay, Dark Knight. Gauge looks the same. Does it? The, the big circle looks slightly different. The harder, it'd be easier to tell when he actually gets the uh, gets some dark side going. Still got that. Aoe. That looked new. That definitely looked new. Do they have an upgraded basic combo now? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, no, it looks about the same. Still got the Simulacrum. Whoa. Hey, they have their own version of Sheltron now. <laughs> what the shit? Dude, Dark Knight always looks bonkers. Oh. Ooh. Ooh! Oh, I'm looking on this. I'm liking the music here. Oh, look at that bow on the bard. Looks like a giant crossbow. <laughs> Ooh, that was new. Oh, was that them changing songs? Damn! That's straighter shot, it sounded like. They have an upgraded straighter shot? Yep, Refulgent. I recognize that one. That looked new. There's Apex. The upgraded Apex. Get some music going. Oh. Oh. Calling down some music. Okay, summoner time. Still got the three crystals. Leading Phoenix right now. I'm interested to see what the summoner changes are going to be like. I'm hoping that they uh, they do add a little more complexity to the class, just a wee bit. All right, some new basic skills that don't require summons. Some very cool looking basic skills that don't require summons. Damn! I think all of those were new, or upgraded versions. Okay. Going through an effort phase. Immediately transitions to Titan. Doesn't even bother spending anything in Titan. Okay, so they're clearly they're not adding anything new to the, uh, to the summoner phases. Because they're just transitioning in and out of them as fast as possible. What the shit is that? Dude, Bahamut got an upgrade! <laughs> so what are we calling this? Neo Bahamut? Bahamut Arisen? Shin Bahamut? That is so cool looking. Also, I love the background of this area. It's very technological. Samurai. Gauge doesn't look much different. Okay. Nice. Get their two spender. Oh, the two. Sp oh, right. I think they changed that in uh, midway through Endwalker, where the the two spender AOE is no longer a cone. It's a it's a circle. That was cool. Get the single target ones in. Get your three. All three stickers. There we go. That looked new. I did not recognize that. Oh. Oh, their three spenders got an upgrade. Scholar, like the, the healer class I literally know the least about. Gage hasn't changed much. Still have change stratagem. That definitely looked new. I don't recognize that. Oh! A 
bonus for getting hit? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Calling down some multiple little fairies there, Seraph. Definitely some cool new looking. Oh, here we go. Show me that Pictomancer, baby. Oh, oh, damn it. Oh, that's cool. Oh, they have little stickers, and I just realized my face is covering up their job gauge. Dang damn it. <laughs> oh, I have to change that here in a bit. We'll, we'll go back over some of these. That's that's wild looking. Oh, paint wings. Oh, they can paint themselves weapons! Oh, they're assembling a Moogle. Oh, a paw. Spend the paw. They still haven't spent that ship thing. Oh, teeth. Oh, I see. Dependent on the three things they use, they get a different creature. So what we thought was a Moogle looks like something very different. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Okay, Pictomancer looks like it's going to be a friggin' blast, and I love it. <laughs> what the shit? Oh, Gunbreaker. I almost forgot about Gunbreaker. I thought they'd say we do Pictomancer last. Mm-hmm. Ooh. The stab into the ground thing's definitely new. Standard bread and butter. Oh, draw some cartridges. He has a draw attack now. I love that. There's their six parter. That's not that's the there, that's still there. Ooh, that looked new. Oh, big upgraded combo. <laughs> Damn, okay, the jobs look look like a blast. Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, okay. We're gonna we're gonna go back and look at a couple of these again here. Uh, whose job gauges was I cover covering up? Unfortunately, quite a few of them. Okay, better question. Whose job changes were I covering up that were, you know, different? I think Astro. So give me just a sec. We're going to move my booty over here. Over here. So you guys can see the Astro gauge, because I imagine I was covering up. Yeah, I was definitely covering it up. So yeah, see, now they, um, they don't have the symbols anymore. Instead, we now have actual, three actual cards stored, and the Minor Arcana is still here. And I'm 99% sure their Minor Arcanas were AoEs now. Yeah, they are. They are AoE cards. Okay. Who else did we... Who else was I covering up that had new gauges? Reaper was about the same. Red Mage was about the same. Machinist was the same. Ninja. Come on, the new gauges had to be in the freaking bottom right, man. All the new gauges had to be in the bottom right. Oh, they did the wind skill right at the beginning and I didn't even notice it. It's an AOE tornado now. Yeah, there's no more buff. Instead, we've got these kunai meters here going. Huh. That's cool. So where do we get one? Oh, there we go. We get two of them off of that combo. Now, where do we spend them? That's the question. Where do we spend them? I haven't spent any yet. Oh, there we are. Our combo ender spent one. Do we spend any more? Currently, no. No? 
Only ever spends the one. Interesting. Very interesting. Sage was the same. Black Mage, we could see the gauge. Viper, we could see the gauge. White Mage was the same. Monk was another new one. You guys couldn't see the Monk gauge because unfortunately my stupid uh, webcam was on top of the thing. But Monk's got this. This is cool. This looks like it represents the three stances. And he was, he was spending this resource a lot. And eventually he spent the first of each of these. So he just maxes out Chakra immediately. He goes through his normal combo. And then he gets, yeah, he gets these charges. And then he spends that one. Gets another. And spends it again. Interesting. It's like every time he goes in the stance, he either gets a charge or spends it. It's, yeah, now he's not getting any charges. Now he's just spending. Still looks so cool. And I love that their gauge is glowing. So this must mean that they've got a super. Which is that, yep, there it is, that. That big tornado blast. And I love the Hadoken. I love the Hadoken right there. Uh, Black Knight's gauge was the same. Bard's gauge was the same. Summoner's gauge was mostly the same until they summoned the Shin Bahamut. Uh, Samurai's was the same. Scholars, we could see. Pictomancer, this was the big one. Let's go over Pictomancer again. Because you guys could not see the gauge when we were going through this the first time. Look at this. Look at the gauge on this thing. So we've got two different mechanics going on here. We've got the, the creature assembly gauge over here, which is, he's you know, he's drawing a palm. And that's going to end up up here when he spends the palm. And then we've got this one, which I was not paying any attention to. Yep, palm, there's the mallet. And there's the shooting stars. Some basic spells, I imagine. Oh, do they have a combo system that they're going through? Red, green, blue. I wonder if they are. And that got him some meter and he got him a charge here. There's he spending the palms. Getting ourselves a new picture. Oh, I wonder if this is going to be like the card system that Astros have where they just, they draw a card and instead of, you know, getting a card, they get a picture. All right, spending the mallet. And he keeps this mallet for a while. Yep. Oh, yeah, you see, oh, hold on. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. We just, I just saw something for half a second. No, go back a little bit. When he spent the wings, he was able to turn these two into a Moogle. And he spends the mo Oh, he gets a Moogle, but it didn't spend the charges. Interesting. Then he gets a paw. Spends the paw. But those don't make anything. Oh, oh. Oh, it was four. It took him four to make a creature. Or maybe that paw alone just immediately summons this. Also cleared his board. Dropping ice. Dropping earth. He's got what looks like a ley lines going here. There's that awesome little creature he summons. And then he's got a meteor. <laughs> and it even looks like he's got a bard skill there at the end. Oh, I am looking forward. Pictomancer is definitely the winner so far, but I want to see Viper again. I want to see Viper again. I know now I'm technically blocking their job gauge. So let me move myself back over. So I'm not blocking their job gauge. Okay. So we've got a lot going on here. We've got what looks to be something similar to the Reaper gauge with their shroud. They're building up, and when they go into that big dragon install, they get charges here. We've also got the sword, and the sword gets, like, there's two different parts to the sword here. Yep, he's got a resource down here he's spending. Yeah, see, this, now the swords, he's got one charge, now he's got two charges. 
We spent them all on that. I'm very curious how this is going to play. It just seems like he gets that from his combo. I thought the sword would show uh, whether he was in single sword or double sword stance. There's the dragon install. Dude, he is a freaking lunatic when he's in this mode. You know how fast he is. Right, does he spend the big blue gauge? He never spends the big blue gauge. Interesting. Not once. Right? No, it only ever goes up. I don't think this meter ever goes down once. Oh, wait, hold on. Both sides going red. Okay, both sides going blue. Only one side glowing red. And only one side glowing blue. That's very interesting. Yeah, we never see him spend this gauge, though. Hmm. I figured that the gauge would be set to go into the install, but apparently not. Yeah, no, he never spends the gauge. Weird. Hmm. I wonder what that gauge is spent on then. I'm very curious. Now, th these job action um, trailers, I should be very clear. These are not the optimal way to play these classes. Never. These exist solely to show off the new stuff and maybe show off some basic combos. But they are definitely not the optimal way to play. I learned that the hard way when I tried to watch the Reaper one. He's like, oh, this is how you play Reaper. No, it's not how you play Reaper. It's not even close to how you play Reaper. <laughs> oh, boy. Wow. Dude, these things look so freaking wild. I cannot wait to play this. Oh, man. Oh, are there any sweets? Are there any that just I really want to see again? Are there any that just I really, really want to see again? Let's, let's, I want to see Dragoon again. Because Dragoon was going to be the class I was going to play if I can't get to play Pictomancer. And let's move my uh, let's move myself over here, so you guys can at least see the gauge. It hasn't changed much, if at all. I don't think the gauge really changed at all. I still got the Mirage diving. Uh, interesting, we're not building up to uh, Life of the Dragon anymore with Mirage dives, so. though. That got him a charge. He goes right into Gear Skull Gold, going to Life of the Dragon. There's Nastrum. Gets his second charge, immediately spends those on the Wormling Thrust. Goes to Star Diver, and then into the new jump. Which looks like it's got Red Mage abilities on it, because it's... Um, that last jump there. No, back up a little more, sir. Back up a little more. There's Star Diver. Yeah, look at the patterns there. Look at the patterns. That looks just like a Red Mage ability. It looks so much like Scourge. Okay, that's the big Crystal Rain. Like, come back up a little bit. Yeah, see... It's got the same sigil thing going on here with Red Mage. I wonder if there's some crossover. I wonder if there's some crossover. If, you're, if your Dragoon trainer is going to be like, hey, I learned these techniques from watching some Red Mages go off. Hmm. Interesting. I always like it if there's lore reasons for why skills exist and why they look the way they do. Like, Stardiver looks the way Stardiver does because it's the skill you basically stole off of Nidhogg when he was possessing Astinian. That's why Star Diver looks the way Star Diver does. Oh, so much to look forward to. And uh, I'm going into this, the job trailers. I haven't seen the live letter yet. The live letter is technically still playing while I'm going through this. So I haven't read any of the changes, haven't heard any of the live letter stuff going on. I'm very curious. I'm very curious. But that's gonna be it for this one, guys. If you've enjoyed this, please leave a like and favorite and subscribe to join me for some Eorzean butt whooping. I cannot wait to get my hands on these skills, these new job actions. Oh, they always look so good. Not to mention Dragoon and Astro reworks. 
both of those classes kind of needed uh, dragoons especially dragoon was i don't think dragoons actually had a rework yet no it hasn't i've just been adding on to it constantly hmm. anyway i'll see you in the next video